I can't help but keep coming back to this game. I'm, I'm just somewhat addicted to it. Um, now, let's see. Uh, I have added new redeem into the channel points because, I mean, it comes up every few months just like, hey, why aren't there more redeems? So since I've been doing the warrior voice as of late, since Nick there's already redeemed one, Basically, you can make me do the funny voice at any time, so I can just go, oh, yes! And that's redeem number one done. Alright, but you can only do it once every half hour, because I know a lot of you have points saved up, and I don't want to have to scre keep screaming that, like, for two hours straight. So that's done. Um, and there's two new emotes, one... That's, you know, anyone can use, which is just, uh, this one here. You know, Wario's face with, oh yes. And, uh, a shaking one. Which is a subscriber one, so. That's pretty much it. Uh, where is my vampire survivors? Oh, right, window capture, that's why. There we go. I forget that, uh, yeah, this uses a different capture source. You wish you didn't have in the work work in the morning where you'd have to be super awake around fourth graders. I mean, fourth graders are practically adults. They can take care of themselves, can't they? <laughs> and thank you for the 31 months, dude. Yes, yes. All right. We'll see how short-lived this uh, channel point redeem thing is. Because I get the feeling, at least initially, it'll be going off every half hour. But for now, I'll leave it in. Uh, yeah, so... I kind of need to go around the board and play as characters that I haven't played as yet. So, Because I would imagine it unlocks more stuff. This character was cool, but kind of a pain. Uh, who haven't I played as? The tree was was just stupid. Good call putting a call down on that. You could make me do it a disgusting amount of times. I mean, listen, I'm I'm still gonna do it voluntarily. Like if I'm playing a game a game where Wario is in it, then um you don't need to redeem. I'll just do the voice. But yeah, uh, kind of figured. Hmm, I think half an hour is good. Fifteen minutes. I feel like it would just get overused. I th I think twice in an hour is fine. But we'll see. We'll play it by ear. Yeah. I'll go... Llama LaDonna? Okay. And, uh, let's just... I still haven't discovered this yet. Let's see if there's any... Okay, there's an art a relic to get here, so let's try and get that. Apparently somewhere here. What? What am I? Okay. Some of these relics, you need to do something very specific, so we'll see. But yeah, I wanted to open up with this, and uh, then we'll do some more cultic, because I've been having a lot of fun with that game. Uh, anyway, what's new, everyone? How's the first week of the new year treating you? I've had uh, a busy week, but I went out and got some... Uh, some pasta for dinner at, a, at an Italian place. It was good. Just, uh, gnocchi. Hadn't had it in a while, and yeah, it was nice to get out. Plus, you know, nice day. It's warm, but not too warm. Just when it's indoors, you know, changing clothing. That's about it. I mean, on the side, I've just been, like, kind of messing around with some videos. Uh, like, I'm trying to do some scripted content for YouTube. It's not original stuff, but it's kind of... 
instead of just stitching a highlight video together, I'm going to try and do something with narration, so... Hopefully you'll see more of that soonish, but yeah, just kind of working through it. Mostly good to report from your neck of the woods. You passed your server test and made server. You've also turned 30, so... There's that. When did you turn 30? Dirty 30. Well, welcome. Welcome to the club. Well, like, people start calling you Chugi and, uh, old. Dirty 30. So I don't quite understand what I'm supposed to do here. According to the map, there's, a, there's an artifact here, but I'm not sure. Uh, yeah. Let's go. Yeah, what I like about this game is I can... Not only is it fun, but I can also have a beverage. As it really only requires one hand. Oh, you can get Summon Knight now. Yeah, that's fine. Today? Oh, dude, happy birthday. I thought you were saying, like, you turned over, uh, the new year or something. You had work today, so no irresponsible drinking. Well, I mean, there's... There's the weekend for that. Yeah, got any plans? I only ask because it's, it's like a... I guess... A milestone birthday. I don't know, I'm one that I only really treat milestone birthdays seriously anymore. Like, my one's coming up, but, like... Oh, shit, I guess it, it technically is a milestone birthday, but it's the... Yeah, okay. But not not a big milestone, it's just, like, I think anything in intervals of five is, like, a milestone. But, I mean, uh, I'm probably just gonna see family, maybe a couple of friends, and that's it. Just... I always keep it low-key at this point. I think this year it falls on a Friday as well, which is kind of nice, and there's a public holiday in Australia the day before. So I guess I should put... Yeah, I'll do it tomorrow. Like, put a leave request for that day. Get a bit of a long weekend. It'll be good. Nothing solid plans, so people want to take you out, but to be honest, you had your heart set on a Big ass birthday steak, that's all you want. Hey, listen, dude. That sounds perfectly fine to me. I mean, you could potentially do both, but like, if that's all you're feeling, that's all you're feeling. I'm trying to figure out what exactly it wants me to do here. Also, this is bad. I need something to defend my character a bit better. Am I? Let's go. Let's go, cats. Let's send out exploding cats. Because we got AoE and that'll be nice to work with. And I might get projectile speed as well. 
Okay, there we go. There we go. There's something. I'm gonna move towards where... So according to this, it's somewhere here. But what is... Like, this is the thing that I can't figure out. Like, what do you, what do, you do? You keep forgetting we're the same age. <laughs> yeah. I mean, how old do, do you think I am? Before you remember. You know, for some reason I still get people thinking that I'm I'm younger than what I am. Oh, wait, there. It's just there. What is this? Permanently allows changing music. Oh, that's... Okay, I thought it was something big. But sure. You're only as old as you feel. Can somebody feel you and tell you how old you are? Ah, <laughs> oh dear. That's that's such a dad joke. Did say bracer, so let's get bracer. It's not quite ready to change into the new weapon yet. Uh, I don't know. That's... In your mind, I'm ageless, facely, and semi-omnipotent. Like, I can appreciate that. I mean, you're, you're basically describing almost an AI type. Oh, yeah, I suppose I can grab that. Uh, if I get... So, hang on, let me see. Stone mask, book. That covers that. Yeah, okay. Oof. That's brutal. I'm not sure I'm gonna survive here. I'm a little bit on the back foot here. Floating bodiless hand, oh boy. You know, you can you can blame those people that were in my chat like how many years ago now? I, I don't even know. I'm just making it's just such a big deal of like using a webcam when it came to streaming that it kind of permanently put me off the idea. <laughs> Stone mask, spellbinder. Yeah. Spellbinder, stone mask, and then. Yep, yeah, okay. Let's go. Let's 
Sorry, just thinking in my head. Out loud. So really thinking out loud. I'm th um, like, I've had a long day in case it wasn't obvious. Alright, there we go. Scythes. I mean, if the dystopian YouTube future is anything to believe, if I want some semblance of success, <laughs> I will have to, to show my face on YouTube videos. The reference to that is apparently some content creator got a message from YouTube like that uh, some of their content had limited monetization because it didn't feature them enough or some shit. Yeah, I don't know, like... On the one hand, YouTube's doing great stuff in the streaming space, but on the other hand... The stuff like, uh... People getting... Demonetized because they're swearing too much... That's going... Absolutely crazy at the moment. I think it's something like, if you drop an F-bomb in the first few minutes of your video, it gets demonetized. Which, yeah, I don't know, like... I've talked about this before, but I just find it absurd that, like... So these advertisers, they want to... Connect with a demographic, right? To advertise to them. But then... You know... They get to connect with that demographic with a particular content creator. And then they go, oh no, the content this creator's making, that's not suitable for us. It's like, well, no one gives a crap about whether or not it's suitable for you. Like, that's what your demographic enjoys. Stop trying to change it. So, I mean, that's more or less what's happening on YouTube at the moment. It's just different things. You see the stories pop up all the time. Like, another one was uh, just a recording of a Street Fighter tournament. They said that the video was too violent. And so that video got demonetized, even though it's just gameplay footage of Street Fighter at a tournament. So... Historically, they have a habit of terrible policy updates that are terribly communicated to the creators. Yeah. I think right now it's just... They're relying a lot on AI and automation to kind of uh, police YouTube, which is fair enough. Like, if you look at... The sheer amount of content that is uploaded on a daily basis to YouTube, like, there's no way hum they could have a team of humans doing that. It's understandable, but, like, there's an inner- there's a guilty until proven innocent system there. And even then, like, to go through that process, it's- unless you have a large following and can make a large enough, you know, fuss about it, you probably won't get anywhere, and even then... I've tried to watch how much I've been swearing lately. Um, it's not just a result of uh, YouTube, for the record. It's more like, I guess, a few times already I've heard my cousins say that they've watched my streams. So I'm like, oh no. Yeah, that's right. They're getting, they're getting old enough to be on the internet. And it's kind of like... Look, I'm gonna- I'm going to say things that are adult in content, that's fine, but like... I think having the need to constantly swear, I don't have to do it. So I've- I've kind of started being like I, I'm at work. I know that sounds bad, but not really, it's just... I'll still drop a swear word in at work, but it's mainly for emphasis, right? Or to be funny. But I, d I think I definitely, like, said it a little too much, so. I don't know. I don't think it'll be noticeable. And the other thing is with the new channel, I am censoring swear words, so. It's kind of like, I treat it like how South Park used to be on TV and have F-bombs censored. So then, the, you know, the channel doesn't automatically get flagged as, Oh no, this is adult and we won't put this in the algorithm. kind of the reality of it. And I know that 
it's working because the live stream recordings have gotten better viewership than like the uploads I've done of the Twitch recordings. And the only the only difference is the YouTube live streaming streams have almost no swearing in them. Yeah, the latest you heard is if you say potty mouth word in the first five minutes, boom, demonetized. There's a bunch of other stuff as well that's like instant demonetization, but that is the main one. The big one now is like if you drop a C bomb, uh, that one is a big no no. So, you know, rip Australian content creators. <laughs> but yeah, that one I've definitely tried to not say. And that one's easy enough. Okay, let me look at this. So that's evolved. That's evolved. This one, we're gonna get the evolution. That's done. Stone Mask is the cat's eye. So now I guess I kind of get a free choice. I could go the Bracer and just go Knives. Let's go Knives. Okay. Just to kind of match this character's archetype, you know? Yeah, I mean, I don't mind toning down the swearing. I think as long as I can keep conversations more or less adult, it's still fine. But the moment that kind of comes into play where it's like, well, you have to make content suitable for children, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just never going to do that. It's like, heaven forbid people pay attention to what their children are doing on the internet. Aussie creators just gotta have a specific sensor word for the C word. Well, I guess the advantage we have is sometimes the way we say it, it just sounds like we're saying can't. So, the AI doesn't really pick it up all the time. Some of the automatic subtitles, yeah, definitely just come up as can't. Which, good. <laughs> But, you know, I can't rely on that forever. I mean, look, that one's, that one's not a big loss. For me, it, like, okay, I want to connect with an adult audience, right? That's, that's basically it. And you can still do that without, like, being a sailor. I was watching one of my favorite streamers, um, Vinny from Vine Source, and so he's trying to cut down on this swearing as well, and for one stream he had one of those, uh, you may have seen them, just the jelly, be jelly beans that like, it's a roulette. W one color of jelly bean either has a tasty flavor or a disgusting flavor, and so every time he dropped an F-bomb, he would have to eat a jelly bean. And there was that one point where he just kept saying it. Like, <laughs> just could not, could not stop saying the word. And it was just such a, a mind melt. It was, it was hilarious. Because, you know, if you're in the habit of saying it, it's really hard to kind of get out of it. I, I don't think I'm to that extent. I think I can cope without it. I just have to s flip that switch where I'm like, okay, I'm at work. Like, I can get away with one or two, but like, multiple, nah. Unprofessional. So, that's not hard for me to do. Oh, what is, why? Why is this struggling so much? As long as you feel like it's natural and not sensor how I'd normally communicate, it's fine, right? Yeah, I guess that's the thing, is like... It also depends who I'm hanging out with. Like, I think with certain people, I definitely swear a lot more. 
but I think me as a person, I like if you were to put me in a normal average situation, I don't swear that much. It's just in the context of gaming, I've all, especially when things aren't going my way. Yeah, it, it does happen. Oh no, I'm definitely going to lose. My character's not being defended here. I think I needed garlic. Hang on. Oh no. Yeah. I think I'll... That's it. Okay, well, that's okay. I'll try again. That was not easy. Oh, you got music now. That's cool. This is great. I like the music selection. To be honest, the way you talk to your friends sometimes would make your grandma disown you. Luckily, the service work filter is strong. Yeah, exactly. Hmm. Let's secure that right away. See, I'm not too fussed about it. It's a mild annoyance. And at the end of the day, it's just like, uh... See, I'm not sure this worked well. I think... The problem with getting this early, I need to get... Well, we'll see. I don't think it works that well early on, but then later it's really strong. But I'll try it again. I think the way I have it is kind of like, I'll treat my new channel on YouTube as kind of like... TV friendly. <laughs> like, still adult, but like... You know, when I upload shorts and whatnot, I'll just censor out swear words, but then the other two channels, they'll just be like, yeah, whatever, uncut. <laughs> I think that's the best way to play it. Some of some characters are just so much more difficult than others. I think the axe is a bit lackluster until it evolves, and even then, it's still I don't know. It's not the greatest. Like you can see how much I'm struggling already. Oh yeah, I also went out and, uh, tried to find some more Game Boy games. I got a copy of Wario Land 3, so that's nice. So that'll happen at some point.
It's very happy about that one. I've never played it. I need garlic. Uh, Alright, just get more of this one. Yeah, honestly, I can't imagine what it would be like if, like, some of my older relatives <laughs> saw the kind of stuff I say on here. I mean, look, I, I love my family, but some of them, they're a bit old school. Garlic, yeah. Okay, this is gonna make life better. Stick to the axes, make them strong. Two more. One more. Cool. 
Oh yeah, right. I gotta press escape. I figured out that you can swap these and just kind of skip the cycle. Still, still struggling. Uh. Ooh. I don't know. I guess let's just get this. I think it does add one more axe. I think I might even add one more explosion to the thing, I'm not sure. Okay, that we definitely want. Yes, yeah, so I'll just get that. I want to make the, the fancy explosion for the next level, but it's not giving me yet. Oh, come on. The fancy fireworks, that's what I, I want to level up. There it is. Okay. I won't pick it up just yet because I think it requires this to be higher level. I'll get this. I'm gonna try and get up tomorrow morning as well to continue Zelda. Because I've heard that that game has a second quest and it's like ridiculous how different it is later. And it's piqued my curiosity enough. Plus, you know, it gets, gives me a chance to play as the chicken more, which I've been enjoying thoroughly. Oh, right, I can... Ooh. Ooh, that's interesting. That might work. Oh, this already works well. This looks cool. Grabbing this because I'm afraid. <laughs> Plus another one's going to drop anyway. Okay, it's fine. Uh, okay, two more. I think this is working pretty well. OK. 
Okay, one more. Really doesn't want to give me that. Okay, I'm getting orb. Uh, Spanish. That's it. All right, let's go. There we go. Time for magic. Beautiful fireworks show. Cooldown reduction. And there we go. Alright. Now I can just work on making this really strong. Like it's not already, but Yeah, this is this is good. Yes! Give me all the orbs. There's multiple chests here. Let me just level up one more time. Okay, one more and that gets to evolve. That's it. Alright. Cool down. Fireball. You know, I just need to head over to that chest. Wow, it didn't give me it. That sucks. Okay, garlic is now max as well. There was a bat there, I don't think we were at one. I have no idea where I got pushed to. Oh no, it's on top of me. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. There we go. And now I'm basically untouchable. 
There's no way they're getting through this. That thing is going off like every three seconds. Keep going, cool down. This must be really hard to watch on mobile for bad uh, internet speed. <laughs> I imagine it would just be a blur at this point, like you can't even tell what's going on. Okay, let's book. Yes! I still haven't figured out a way to survive past the half hour mark, really. Aside from the doggo being able to outrun them, but... I haven't yet figured it out. Labora. Okay, big coin. I'll probably do one more round of this and then go to Cultic. I just wanted to get my fill in. <laughs> Make progress with a character. Okay, here it is. Get the freebie. I'm gonna head to the silver ring now. No, wait, the left body part. Just make sure I haven't... Okay. Haven't dropped any chests. Oh. 
Random clover. Please tell me I haven't accidentally walked past it. Ah. Oh. Okay, fine. I don't know what point that happened. I just have to keep checking. I don't know, beyond, like, something in the game screaming HACK! I don't think I'll be able to tell when a chest has dropped at this point. It's kind of just... If I'm moving, I'll probably miss one. Get him! Fire! Oh, that was quick. Alright, where, where's the item, though? I, I, I can't... Oh, there it is. <laughs> I couldn't see a thing. Okay, there we go. Oh, there's a chest here. Convenience! All right, so that's that's now, dude. What on earth? <laughs> what was that? I'm level ninety nine. All right, I'm heading to the ring now. Yeah, look at that money. Oh, is it pulling all the orbs to me? I think it is. I'm just running away from them. Just feels like I'm doing a Mario bonus stage, just all the coins. Got the chest for good measure. There must have been a big chest because it got me quite a bit of money. Ok. 
Okay. Let's see how long it takes to kill him. It shouldn't take that long. All right, that was pretty quick. That was pretty quick. Also, I'm not sure what that number means. It's like 0 0.01, but then that icon's the revive icon. So how do you get 0 0.01 of a revive? Doesn't make sense. I'm gonna try and get the gold ring, because why not? What else have I got to do here? Probably wasn't worth the time. It's okay. Alright, down the road we go. I can make it. Oh. <laughs> that was so hard to see amongst all the chaos. Two and a half minutes, just under. I can get it.
Oh, come on. I have to be close. It's about a minute left. Have I not reached it? There it is. Got it. Okay, get. Got 30 seconds. Jeez, that was quick. Oh no, I leveled up the ring again. <laughs> There's no escaping death. Alright, it's fine. Skullomaniac. Okay. Survive 30... Yeah, so now I've got the skull now. I don't think there's anything left here. Ignores cooldown. Weapons fire fixed intervals when moving. That one seemed interesting. But I'm going to go with like some of the more vanilla characters because they would most likely have unlocks behind them that I haven't done. Um... Like this dude, I never won with this dude. I reckon go library. We got cooldown books in here too. Yeah, this is probably a, a good contender for this. It's going to cover a large amount of the, the screen. Garlic, yeah, there we go. I don't like... I don't like knives, that's the problem. I think that's why this character's hard. Sure. Yeah, I got the duplicator nice and early. Uh, we're gonna get cooldown anyway. Brace up. I guess that's the three items for now. Let's get a second garlic just to make this a little more comfortable. Not, yeah, let's go Laurel.
Bible. Alright, I feel a bit better about this. Not really sure what to make my last item here. Maybe Roaring? Since I got Duplicator. Make it ring. do this because we got free uh item slots the evolution. It's okay. Alright, I'm gonna start heading to the left. I might get a uh, movement speed for my last passive. I'm not sure what else would benefit, really. We're gonna get cooldown book anyway. Yeah, Alright, let's get Bracer. Still not enough. Oh, good.
Hey, another orb. I think this is working pretty well. Okay, another one. Very useful. Alright, that's Bryce and maxed out, so next time I get a chest it should give me the knives. Just that is sad. Another free book. You can definitely hear the difference, like the knife sound effect. It's getting more aggressive. Was great at cutting a path. Take the time here to collect. because I'm going to get another free book. Doesn't matter. got in any chests, that's the unlucky thing. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, finally. Eight knives. No, oh, no, knives, knives are good once they're evolved, so just at the start they're a bit of a struggle bus.
When I saw this attack in Castlevania, I was so satisfied, but it's so much fun. Oh, oh, right. Ugh. To deal with two of them now. Okay, one of them's dead. And we got the book now, so that's good. Okay. I think if I just keep doing this, it should be straightforward to get the kill. Look at its struggle. There we go. Get destroyed. Okay. Right, now I'm heading to the other side. I probably should have gotten the orb. So then I can pick up stuff easier, but eh. I don't think they're going to touch me, and even if they do, I've got some contingency plans. Alright. Yeah, they're not touching me now. This effect is pretty much covering the whole screen. Just a shame I can't collect all the orbs, they're too far away. Two more till garlic. One more. Okay, there we go. Okay. I will be shocked if they can get to the middle of us. Oh, damn it! Oh well. I mean, that's fine. 
There's still items to have gotten. Alright, I gotta start moving. Oh, yes! Come to me, my orbs! I'm just gonna keep walking now. How far away am I? Surely I'm ages away. Yeah, okay. Ugh. All right, I need to go, go, go. And check, just check every now and then that I'm not walking past the chest. I think the key thing with every character is just to reach level 80, so that's gonna happen. the stone mask. We shouldn't be too far away from the next one. Let's see how we go. Oh no, this thing is stun locked. It's not moving. <laughs> Ridiculous. 
Yeah. It can't, it can't get in here. Oh, it's like very slowly edging. There we go. Too late. <laughs> Damage achieved. Yep. Okay, jeez, that was a lot of level ups. I mean, the knives are great. I love the knives. It's just early on they suck. But when they're at this point, they are really strong. An enemy will never reach you. Just early on, they're, they're a struggle. I've never liked them. Just stick around here for a little longer. Okay. Yeah. Caps incoming damage at 10 retaliates when losing char charges. Alright, there we go. Now I have this fancy cape. I can only ever take 10 damage. Alright, I guess all that's missing is the gold ring. There's still quite a bit of time left. Okay, let's see if we can do the same to this one. <laughs> oh, this one might reach me. This one might reach me. Come on, knives! Knives! Okay. <laughs> I had to move. In all fairness, I think it has more health than it did because of the, uh... the right piece of the cape increasing enemy health. But still... Okay. There we go. <laughs> Cheers for the follow as well. Uh, that's so funny. Alright. Well. I guess that's it. Now we just wait out the last seven minutes. I probably shouldn't get the gold ring. I guess to flex, it's like, yeah, look, they have all this extra health and they're still melting.
also kill count and damage you. I suppose. Just, I may have already got them all, but I guess we'll see. Uh, to be honest, I haven't looked at the achievement list. Like, either way, there's no chance any normal enemy is getting to the middle. Where did you come from? I couldn't even see it. Okay, it's fine. So much going on that I, I just, I really did not see that thing sneak up on me. I guess that's it. Uh, level up's just giving me uh, coins now. I mean, I guess I could sit still. I, I don't think they're reaching the middle. There's nothing else on this map, right? Yeah, not really. <laughs> that is it! The only thing I can think of is run around searching for a magnet to pick up everything. The orbs... I've noticed that it doesn't quite pick up everything, but most things. But yeah, I mean, eh, I'm like one, one, one already. I'll just spend these last few minutes here. This is a pretty high level race. I 
mean, I'm sure people have done better, but like, for me at least. It'd be cool if I could reach 120, but I doubt it's going to happen. Maybe. Oh, I'm not gonna make it. No. Oh, there it is. Orb. Oh. Last second orb. Holy crap. <laughs> I don't think I've survived that dude that long. Okay, I gotta revive. Go. <laughs> 20 extra seconds. It's probably the longest I've done that naturally. Alright. Unlocked blue iron will Divano. Who is Divano? Nothing here. Divano, where is he? There. Laurel. Starts with one extra level, gains one armor. Interesting. Okay, well, that's enough for that. I just wanted to play it for a bit. I'm gonna stretch my legs for a couple of minutes, and then I'm gonna play some Cultic, because I've been having a lot of fun with that. So, if you don't know what that is, it's a shoot FPS shoot game that's, like, got a pretty cool graphic style, because I tried to mimic, like, an 80s uh, FPS game. But, you know, the graphic quality is cool. It's just got this gritty aesthetic to it, so I'm gonna play a bit more of it. But first, I need to stretch my legs, so... Get yourself a snack or something, and I'll be back shortly. But if you're here for Vampire Survivors, thanks for watching. I'll do more of it in future.